Also happening today, suspects arrested after the discovery of a cult leader's body are making their first court appearances. CBS4 investigator Rick Salinger live in Moffitt for us this afternoon, where the leader was found dead in a home. So, Rick, what's the latest on this case? Well, Kelly, we are standing outside of the home where that body was found of Amy Carlson. We are in an area known as Casitas Park. You could see over here on a trailer, they have written the name of this cult, Love Has Won. The body was found inside the house a short distance away in a bedroom in the back. The sheriff's department says the body was in a sleeping bag and wrapped in cloth, mummified. That sleeping bag was was decorated with Christmas lights, and Amy Carlson had glitter on her lips. It was described as kind of a shrine. Seven members of this group were taken into custody. Those arrested are appearing in court on a variety of charges, the most serious of which is tampering with the deceased body. That cause carries a maximum 12-year sentence. Then it involves five people who are accused of transporting Carlson to Colorado from California. It is not known how she died, but at this point, foul play is not suspected. Now, one person who was arrested appeared in court this morning. Six more are due this afternoon. The bonds range from $2,000 to $50,000. So far, we understand no one has been released. Now, if you're trying to make sense of all this, keep in mind that this cult leader, Amy Carlson, has said she has been reincarnated hundreds of times and has come back to Earth as such people as Jesus, Joan of Arc, and even Marilyn Monroe. Perhaps that was why they were keeping her here. Live in Southern Colorado, Rick Salinger covering Colorado First.